Hinapia was a South Korean girl group formed by OSR Entertainment. The group was composed of five members, Min Khan, Lin, Jai E. Anwen, Unwoo, and Bada. Hinapia debuted on November 3, 2019 with the single album New Start. Hinapia disbanded on August 21, 2020. Today we are rewinding time. Today I am intervening. I, Nini, will be giving Hinapia their first mini album and their first comeback. But unfortunately we are going to have to make some changes. Bada will not be debuting with an Apia. I have my reasons. Reason number one, I personally believe debuting a trainee that only had some months to prepare for her debut versus four girls who have been idols for years was not a good decision. Bada tried her best but you could definitely tell the difference in experience. So therefore, I won't have her debut with them. Reason number two. It was difficult to find pictures of Bada online for me to even edit with as well. So dot fly high Bada. You fought hard girly pop. Love you. I have her on the album and group picture though as I felt it would be rude to edit her out. But Hinapia is debuting as a four member girl group. Now that I've got that out the way, the scheduling is still the same. They will drop Drip as a pre-release single, promote it and then continue with live stages of covers. In January of 2020, they will announce their debut mini album titled, The New Utopia which is a nod to their name. We're working with no budget here. We want a Mew underscore Gung Slay but we are poor and broke, so instead take my poor imitation of her work here. This is the Vision Straw Besties. Projector, Moonlight, So Silky, So Magical Slay. Now for the mini album, I wanted the title to be bold and in your face with a statement to make the same way Drip was for them. So the title will be no and for marketing we'll have posters of the girls around Seoul, with a red line marked across their face. As for the b-sides, I didn't want to lean too much into the same sound as the title. I wanted to display a more mature sound and show that they can do more than girl crush when the time calls for it. I attached Strip as a CD only offer for the physical sale so the girls can earn proper sales off it. Blah blah. Here's the first mini album, The New Utopia set for January 18th. 2020 <laughs> Then in May 2020, they will have their first comeback with a second mini album called Euphoria. Stylized Euphoria. The U symbolizes Abyss, their fandom name and the Ia is from Hinapia. Basically, this second mini album is a gift from them for their fans for staying with them no matter what. For this concept, since we're still poor niggas, we're doing scrapbook, wacky Y2K girly pop slay. We're taking scraps and turning them into something. I want to continue the consistency in cunt they serve, so instead of going hard hitting, we're taking a more laid back, sexy approach with title track easy. The b-sides will be ointy, flirty and fresh. Something for the girly pops to turn up to. Here's Hinabia's second mini album, Euphoria. I put the Apple Music and Spotify links to both mini albums in the pinned comment. This video was really short because when you're working with a basically premature baby ass debut, there's not really much I could expand on. I didn't really know where Hinapia would take their career but I still miss them a lot. I hope you all enjoyed.